Okay, so let's jump into it. Today I'm gonna to show you behind the scenes of a one product dropshipping store. They make 70 grand profit every year. The business takes 15 hours a week to run and they are dropshipping a product I recommended on my channel about six months ago. So we'll be taking a look at their setup. So I'll show you the products, of course. I'll show you where they're selling the products, which is a crucial part to the strategy. I will also show you the Shopify store and the setup and the information because they haven't followed the traditional kind of product page layout. It's more of kind of like a funnel type. There's lots and lots of different information and bundle offers um, to give the consumer like the different options to really help upsell them and squeeze as much money as possible out of the consumer. And I'll also show you the ad creatives they're using to generate these sales as well. So that being said, let's jump into my Mac and we're straight on to Flipper.com. Flipper.com is such a brilliant product research tool. If you are a beginner watching this video and you're looking for a product to back, when I say back, a product to build a business around, Flipper.com should be your go-to for product research. Every single week you'll find stores like this. Um, and when I say stores like this, I mean stores that have a proven track record of profitable sales. You can filter by the age of them. So this store is one years old. You can filter by how much money they're making. So this one makes about 6,000 US dollars profit every single month. You can filter by their profit margins. So you can find products that have a higher price point if that's the sort of thing that you're looking for. If we move down into the different pieces of background information, the one I want to show you is how many hours a week, if I can find it, where was it? It was somewhere in here. So here, the business requires around 10 to 15 hours per week for managing the online store, customer service and order fulfillment. They do also say somewhere that they have a virtual assistant that takes care of the customer service and order fulfillment too. So you could quite easily run a business of this caliber alongside your current commitments if you do have a nine to five. Obviously, if there's other things outside of that, you may not have that sort of time, but for the most part, the average person watching this video could probably squeeze 10 to 15 hours a week somewhere to make an extra 70K a year. Let's come down into the financials then because I try and stay away from stores that have come to a dying end. So what you'll usually find with a lot of dropshipping stores is they'll go crazy and they'll spike massively in popularity and they'll make loads of money. They will one way or the other fail. They will either supply a poor product that leads to lots of refunds, their ads will die off and you'll see kind of like a slow and gradual death. However, with this store, their ads are still active, so they are or must still be making money. Um, and what we can see is even in last month, yes, the results were modest, only 10K in revenue for May, but they still made $3,000 in profit. I have a mentorship program, just kind of like not to plug it in, but the reason why this is relevant is because one of the questions I ask people before I work with them, um, because I only work with people who have realistic results, people who fill in the questionnaire and say, I want to retire to the Hollywood Hills or I want to buy a Lamborghini or some sort of ridiculous goal in three months. I don't let, I don't work with those sorts of people. I work with people who have realistic and achievable goals that I can help them achieve. And most people do tend to put somewhere in the region of just one to $5,000 extra per month, which is very, very achievable and can significantly impact somebody's life for the better. So let's bring in my tool again, annual revenue 384 um, in turnover, translates into a 71K annual profit, not bad for 10 to 15 hours per week. This is all drop shipping one product too. Let's get rid of this. We can see it's obvious most e-commerce online businesses, their best months are going to be during the Q4 periods. However, given the type of products when I show this to you, yes, you're always going to get extra um, increase in business during Q4, but it's not a seasonal product. It is a product that will sell consistently well throughout the year. So we can see the average turnover is in and around sort of 30K, which translates into profit margins of anywhere from sort of 5 to 10K, uh, maybe even a little bit lower. Let's jump onto Facebook then and take a look at their Facebook page. So you'll see straight away, this is the one products they're selling. This is the products I featured on my channel um, 
I think I've featured it a couple of times actually um, in my product recommendations. It's a brilliant, 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 brilliant product because it suits the perfect market on Facebook, which is grandparents. Grandparents want to get children off of screens, off of iPads and doing something practical. And what this also does is, yes, it's for, or the target market is a grandparent and parent, but it's also something beneficial to the child. It's not just a random toy. It's something that can help develop them and bring them on. Um, so there's lots of different positive marketing angles here for this product. What this product is, is it basically helps children develop their handwriting skills, writing numbers and letters and words. Um, there's different grooves in the paper. I'm not sure if you'll see that on screen. So the child can easily follow through um, and kind of builds up that muscle memory when it comes to developing their handwriting. What's really cool about this too is you don't have to keep rebuying the book, is over time the ink will disappear, which means you get multiple, multiple uses out of it. There's also lots and lots of different variations of this product. Um, you get French versions, Spanish versions, English versions, um, you get drawing options, alphabet, you get mathematical ones. Um, there's so many different versions, there's so much scope here to make a significant amount of money. Let's jump onto their website then. So they don't have a typical Shopify or e-commerce website that you can browse and look around. Um, it's more of kind of like a click funnels landing page funnel type. So when you hit the page, you don't actually see anything that allows you to add it to cart. You have to kind of consume information about the product before you can actually buy it. And I've never had much success myself in e-commerce with this type of strategy. It could just be down to the types of products I'm selling. There is a bit more setup involved. There are apps in the Shopify store on different landing page apps which will allow you to create something similar to this. Um, but it's always worth a try and a test. The more information as well you can get a consumer to consume about your product, the more kind of clued up they are about what it is, what it can do, and the benefits, the much more likely they are to buy it. Think of it, extreme example, but if you're going to buy a car, if a salesman has 30 seconds to spend with you to try and sell you on a car, that's gonna be difficult to do versus if they had two hours. In two hours, you can go on a test drive, they can show you around the car, all the different kind of bells and whistles, and the more information and the more time you spend with something, the more attached um, you're gonna be you're gonna to come to it, if that makes sense. So the more they see all these different benefits, the more they see the different gifts, the more they see how it can benefit and how that translates into helping their child or grandchild, um, the more money, the much more likely to spend, um, or even just at the very minimum make a purchase. So three different options. There's an app that has this, oh, I can't remember what it's called. It's zip pages, I can't remember, it's bugging me now. Um, but you'll find it straight away in the Shopify app store. Um, you can set up these three different offers. Um, what I really like is this recommended one because you can have the most kind of fruitful one or the most profitable one um, and advertise that to encourage people to, to buy it. If you don't have it as your more expensive one either, it makes you come across as a lot more trustworthy because you're not just trying to get people to spend as much money as possible. It's a perfect impulse buy range product. I actually think this is a bit cheap. I think four different books, they could probably sell this for a bit more, um, but you can get one for 15 pounds, four for 26, or four plus this Montessori toy um, for 44. Keep scrolling down, they've got different reviews. This looks like um, looks reviews. Everything is in French if you haven't noticed. I think that's a crucial part to their success. Um, one thing I speak about on this channel a lot is the assumption that drop shipping is saturated, that is not the case. Yes, certain products are saturated, um, but what's more accurate is to say that certain audiences are saturated. So all you have to do, and at least in my opinion, what I think the most effective strategy is, is to take a product that has a proven track record in a saturated market. So basically just take products that everybody calls saturated and put it in front of an audience that is not saturated. Test it in France, test it in Italy, test it in Spain, in Denmark, in Austria, um, in all these different countries and find what works because it will. Lots and lots of information, lots and lots of great videos. And these videos I've seen before as well on AliExpress supplier pages, um, as well as around the internet. So I think it'd be relatively simple um, and quick to get started with this particular product. Let's jump onto the Facebook ads library then. Um, so this is the Facebook page, um, approximately 300 different results. It's a common theme with a lot of successful dropshipping stores. You'll find they've tested, 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 tested 
um, the different primary texts at the top here, the different videos, the different images to really find what works and really fine tune and find that perfect sweet spot because it can be different and the slightest different in the top lines here can affect the results quite dramatically. So if you've only tested one or two ad creatives, you may be doing yourself a disservice and you may need to test some more to find the perfect combination for yourself. So I'll play this so you can see this, let's make it a bit bigger. Um, what you can see is their logo over the top. Um, I'm not sure if you'll hear this, but it's basically somebody speaking in French and these words that are at the bottom here. I've watched this through already though, and what you'll see in a second is there is actual English words over the top here. So this would lead me to believe they've basically um, just ripped some existing content they've found online, put a French speaker over the top with some French subtitles. The person actually selling this business, it's worth pointing out, is French by the looks of it, um, which simplifies things for themselves, obviously. But that's not to say that we can't take advantage of this strategy. You can go into Fiverr, places like Upwork, and you can find people who will do voiceovers in French and their native speakers who will write the subtitles for you for less than $50. It's not a big expense. So you could take what I've shown you in this video and do it in Italy or Denmark or Austria or Australia, all those different countries that aren't quote unquote saturated. With that being said then guys, um, I'm not gonna show you every single video, there's no need. Um, hopefully you guys get the gist. Uh, you see the name of the business, you see the product. I definitely recommend you go and check it out, do your own research. At the very minimum, get alerts set up on flipper.com. Every week you'll get emails from brilliant businesses that are listed on the platform like this that are great for product research. With that being said, guys, before you go, um, I just want to make you aware of my mentorship program, which I shamelessly plugged earlier on in the video. Um, if you are interested in working one-to-one -one with myself, um, who can take you through this entire process and help you build a similar business step-by-step, -step, no matter what level you are currently at, I can walk you through my system. All you need to do um, is head to the description below this video, click the link that says mentorship link. It will take you through to a series of questions. It takes two or three minutes um, to fill out. It's basically, it gives me a chance to kind of filter out those people who aren't serious. I only want to work with people who are dedicated um, to drop shipping and want to make this work. If this is you, make sure you head over there now, fill out those questions. It will take you through to a calendar where you'll be able to book a day and time that suits you. I will meet you on that call and we can have a chat in a bit more depth. Um, about how I can help you achieve your goals. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you in the next one.